actually go live? Hopefully it's coming through. Alright, it's time for Emily Ninja to give this game another try, and hopefully we don't all get I don't get my entire party killed like last time. But it probably will. I'm not great at this game. And apparently oh there it is. Wow, that popped out of nowhere. Let's do this! Alright. We still have the undefendable undefendable trip, which is part of the the first DLC. Of course I'm down. I bought a few characters here and there. Let's check though. Let's see. Now we have a heavy. My Caffeine Alexander. Caleb Geth Gethemo. Let's change that name. Geth. Caleb Geth Vasquez. Jeremy Kernax. Botskin? Eh, that's fine. Frederick Fred Fredro. We have the Hustler. We have Ashler Jeddar. Jedi? Why is his name all big? Call him Ali. I only need one Joel there. Ali Jedi Joel. I like that. Works for me. Ah, six members of a party? I can pick up another character here, but I don't have enough food. God damn, they want 800 for him? That's crazy. And they only have 87, uh, 87 population. Not much in military strength either. Hmm. Let's explore. Let's slow this let's slow this down a little bit. Got plenty of time, maybe. Okay, the Medical One has landed at an abandoned military base. This site is not on the old maps or databases. It looks like it was used to train and develop some sort of special operations unit dedicated to fighting the invaders. But there is a lot of equipment here. Perfect, I'll take tech and material. It's strange to wander about this place. They could have been us. Or we could have been them. I'll take that. Alright, let's keep exploring. I want at least a full party before I start doing uh, main missions. Hmm. Can I trade? Oh, I can trade for... Uh, let's see trade food for materials no food is the most expensive thing when it comes to getting soldiers okay this is close but this is a what is this damn I think this is an assault guy Let's recruit. Of course, that means in uh, a few days, my people are going to start starving. Should have probably waited. Okay. Now, who are you, Stefan? Alright, you're an assault guy. Don't have any weapons for him, though. Let's look at manufacturing. Can I manufacture him an assault rifle? Yes, I can. It'll take eight hours, though. All right, I can live with that. And let's make another clip. I need to waste eight turns. A fleet drone cable is under attack. Hmm. Now the question is, will they last before before I can get this assault rifle finished? Question, question. All right, I got the assault rifle finished perfectly. Well, not perfectly, but at least they'll be ready for this equipment. All right, buddy. 
Uh, you don't have any grenades, but it's what it is. How long does it take to manufacture one? Like five hours? Yeah, like three hours. Okay. Do I wait for a grenade? Okay. Okay, equipment. We can put a grenade on him. Alright, let's save, because we don't have any at all. Uh, keep using the same one. Alright. Okay. They have no defending strength. What is this? Uh, Pandoran, medium level threat. Maybe that's about seven, six, seven enemies. Of course, this would help them like us. And there's a nice reward in it. Wait, one, two, three, four. Oh, fuck. Oh, I fucked up. I forgot. I never put him uh, at the base. Oh, the, and the Mandacore only takes six people. Fuck. That sucks. Alright, fuck it. Alright, let's do it. Deploy the squad. Okay, viral damage will reduce will points at the start of your turn. Okay, and the virus will reduce and inflict less damage at the next turn until the revised until the virus is reduced to nothing. Okay, so it's basically like poison, except it kind of fucks with your will points. Holding position. What does the higher levels look like? I want somebody up top here. Receiving loud and clear. Alright, this is my guy with the pistol. Oh, look at that. Wait, no. Right, there's no protection here. What about here? Running. Okay. Let's get to some higher ground. Armor break, huh? Uh, do a 50 uh, additional shred damage for the next turn. Okay. <laughs> I'll admit, that looked very weird the way he did that. But, what can you do? Enemy in visual range. Hmm. What do you, uh... Now, what do you have? Uh, just a regular machine gun and shield? Alright. Let me back up a little bit. Repositioning, prioritizing speed. Okay. Ready to fire. Hmm. Can I pop that arm? Would be nice. <laughs> Got it! Alright. Are you dead? You're dead. Okay. I love bleed.
no, still just him. Never mind. We're good. Now this is good there. You don't have anything else to do. You're the last one. I can dash you across the map. Okay. Heading out. See what we do. Perfect. Ah, shit. At least three, four. Okay, we're gonna have to move. Shit. Oh no, that's another one. I was right. It's about seven to eight here. Okay, there's a lot of them. Grab yeah. Target missed. Gotcha. Ooh, that was damage. But I dazed him too. All right, looks like he'll be dead next turn. Hopefully. Here. Right there. Preparing to fire. Head moves the double perception ability if I blow his head off. He also has, uh, if I hit the torso, it's Pain Chameleon. Hmm, he backs up. Take it. Where's my sniper? Who can you hit? Wow, that'd be a crazy ass shot. Oh, nice! Hell of a shot, sniper! I gotta move him up some, too. Damn, I should've used quick aim. I'll have to use it next time. Sprinting to position. It's like a bunch of them over here, plus the pain chameleon guy. Moving. That fucking pain chameleon's over here. That try. I'll keep my eyes open. That's two down. Oh. 
Okay, these are items up here are lost. There's no point of rushing my goes over there just to get them blown up. As long as we protect the bottom, the bottom left, that's the most important thing. The bottom left's the most important. As long as that structure stands, the map is we can still win. Can I get that shot? Would be nice. Oh, nice! What am I looking at here? Him? Or him? There's a nice little bunch of meaty chunk there. Not perfect. Here. Yeah, let's... Hmm. So dash causes an action point now. Let's open. Not proficient, but we'll take it. We can take it to our labs and re-engineer it. Now, you can chill. I need my sniper up here. Well, or my... my jumper. So you can jump within 20 miles, right? 20 tiles? Let's try this. Let's get you over here. Have you chill? It's Overwatch. That's the strange thing about this laser pistol. It has serious ass range. Okay, most likely they'll come through this way, I think. That or they'll come around. It's hard to say which is more defensible. We'll go both ways. Holding position. Shit. Oh, fuck. Why aren't you dead? Right, you're like really fucked up. You know, I didn't check your info. Okay, now you're gonna die. So, who can I pop? Your head's all out in the open. Or your chest removes your pain chameleon ability. Get the paint. How does that taste? No, didn't work. Aiming. What's our plan? Damn. That dazed his ass. He's fucked up. If I could, uh, 
Rush costs us a point though, fuck. Okay, how about a grenade? Can I get it to hit both? For my team. Yeah, two for one. Ready to engage. Enemy killed. Should that isn't causing creatures to panic. I don't know what will. Shit, can't hide under anything over here. Alright, you gotta come out of this door somewhere. I'll keep my eyes open. I see him. Oh shit, he's right there. Right there. No, can't hit him. Am I gonna uh, shoot him through the glass? I don't like that. Can I hit him with a grenade Let's though? Let's see now. Man, they really nerfed the fuck out of these grenades. Okay, I take all that back about nerfing the grenades. Moving to position. Mm, there's nothing in there because I grabbed everything. Wait. What about you? You're overwatching the wrong position. Damn it. Are you kidding me? That's, oh. That's, uh, Fuck what? Of course I still have healing. Who hasn't had a kill? Oh, hi. You remember me? So, yeah, I know you tried to kill me and I was really pissed about that. Get fucked. What's our plan? Where's you? No, now Anything? you're panicked. Your chest is damaged. The body. Target missed. Just a bit of oh my gosh! Are you kidding me, guy? All right, if he's panicked, then we can just run up on him. Here, how about this? A full flesh one. Yeah, get fucked, boss. Wow, I barely got anything for that. 83. Skill points. Well, it was more about the everything else. Mostly, no. Fortunately, nobody was injured, so that's all that matters. Tech materials and food. Just what I needed. Especially food. Hmm. Send a laser sniper rifle, and we got their newer on pistol. Sinidrian probably seems strange to me. <coughs> Trying to build a better world, a world radically different from the one most of us grew up in. Well, 
I'm sure it sounds very utopian. But why do we so easily accept the world getting worse and can never imagine it getting better? I'm definitely picking the world can get better because I just want to get some brownie points, so I'm going to brown those a little bit. I'm glad our values are aligned, at least in this matter. Please keep thinking about what kind of world you want to live in. Maybe we can build it together. Okay, we need that. Okay, we got the med kit equipment settled. Research. Cool. We got autopsies now. Okay. The way we're going to do this is that one, tight one. Hmm, start this research. I need to destroy a colony. So let's reverse engineer this. Man. So that's so we'll do autopsies first and then we'll do the reverse engineering. We still have six days left before this mission goes needs to go off. Okay, one of our operatives have reported experiencing repeated lucid nightmares of floating up into the sky, helplessly twisting and turning in a nauseating inducing spiral motion that seems to defy the principles of eucelid space. They always woke up before they could see where they were going, but it sensed but sensed a frightening presence awaited uh, waiting for them there. All scenic horses have lost five stamina? That's bullshit. All right, let's just heal up real quick. Okay, all fully healed. We still got five days before undefensible. Explore. Okay, that's another defense. Let's see, what do they want to trade for? They want to trade material for food? Yes, I'll do that. Yeah, I'll take 60. Take 60 for our 90 food. That'll work for me. Can I take down a Pandoran nest, though? It's a good question. I don't know. Okay, opposite the discovery of the broken remains of experimental Synedrum mobile lab. Apparently the vehicle suffered a contamination failure and there were no signs of the crew. But some of the equipment could be salvageable. Okay, with salvage the equipment without informing them, take everything useful, then inform them. Or inform Syndrome of our discovery and give them the equipment. Bullshit, take everything useful, then inform them. Let's see, Dr. Habenik, a scientist from Sid, from Sid who helped design the lab, sends us a message of thanks. He had argued against deploying it so early but was outvoted. There is little pleasure to be had in being proven right about something so terrible. I wish I knew what happened. I suppose it will always haunt me. But we got four, four uh, added two points for the Phoenix Project and 175 tech. Always a plus for me. Let's see, what do they want for this guy? And they want 345, huh? Hey, they don't have any food. Seven's a good amount of people. Let me look at my personnel. 
Are they all? Would they be all set for a fight? Another grenade, just what he needed. Pistol. Grenade. Mm. There we go. More points for speed. More points for speed, of course. I know this is really risky, all things considered, but... Okay. Now, is a nest the same as a colony, though, is the question. Well, it's not like anyone's watching right now, so we can. Not really a major battle, but I'm saving it as such. Gosh, don't let me die. You know what? Fuck it. Delete that shit. One save. Let's go. Medium threat. Okay, but we have to find and eliminate the Hashlink Sentinels. Okay. Sentinels will trigger if a soldier is in their range or we attack them. Eggs will hatch if soldiers are within their range. Let's go. It'd be nice if I could equip uh, ships with... Um, for more space so I could bring more soldiers. Hopefully I can do that later. possibility of this way going up into that area up here uh, we go behind us or down here in this area hard to tell channel open heading out Charge the area here. I mean, I can't keep sedging. If I send all my soldiers by my by themselves, they probably get murdered. Okay, I'm willing to gamble. Hopefully, that there's nothing over here. Could be wrong though. Fuck. This is just decisions, huh? Okay, we have three soldiers each, so we'll say let's pick two different routes. There's a two assault guys, and I think he is my guy with the long range uh, pistol. Moving out. We take them. No, that's three together. They'll go. There's nothing that's a dead end. We'd have to go around this way. Let's overwatch here just in case one of these guys pop up. I got these covered. Oh, 
on the double. All set. Now you carry a pistol, you can overwatch that. Oh wait, there's something over here. I see it. I see that mist thing. What's our move? Moving. There it is, I knew it. Receiving loud and clear. So the court. Oh no, never mind. I can't. Here. Moving out. Okay. There's kind of a way to see them, whether they're hiding or not. Holding position. You can still move. I gotta find some places to put them defensively. Shit, where? Fuck. I'm fucked. Well, he's eating it. He's eating a lot of damage right now. Right there. Where's the egg at? Oh, the egg's ahead. I'm willing to bet there's one here. I think. It's a gamble. Or two. Okay, you have mass hatch and proximity detection. Okay, that's still a good amount of damage. Kill confirmed. Takes care of that. That was it? I just need to find one? Oh, thank you! Okay, got two level ups though. Got level four, guys. I still need to destroy a colony though. Okay, the layer's been neutralized and abandoned by its inhabitants. See, the rest of humanity can breathe a sigh of relief. But every faction gave us a plus five, so that's a bonus there. You seem to be genuinely on our side. And everyone here at Synedrion really appreciates that. Please understand that we are cautious with organizations such as the Phoenix Project. Not because we're trying to be obstinate, but because we've had some pretty terrible experiences that we'd prefer not to repeat. You know that I have high hopes for an alliance between the Phoenix Project and Synedrion. So my advice is this. 
what would be really helpful right now would be a more direct demonstration of your support. That could really win some hearts and minds. Alright, what you got in mind, lady? Uh, Citizen Athena, I mean. At this moment, we have a couple of really important projects running. The sort that could actually change the future. Like improving our mist repelling tech, which may allow us to peacefully coexist with the new ecology. Or deploying a new breed of modified plant to help us reclaim the planet for ourselves. Believe me when I say we've had a lot of debates about which approach is better. And there are some pretty opinionated factions forming. In any case, we're lacking enough people to support both projects at once. And it's a bit of a deadlock. So if you could lend a hand with one of them, that would mean a lot. I really don't want to join any fashion, but I do want their technology. And a mist repeller would be great all around. I'm not sure if that means uh, mist repellers help in battle or help in uh, the, mist, uh, the mist areas on the geosca uh, geoscape. So we'll use mist repellents. Zara will be pleased to hear that. She is one of the most passionate advocates of, well, some people would say the original values of Synedrion. But it's hardly that simple. She's part of a loose coalition called the Polyphonic Tendency, which advocates solutions that reject all hierarchies, all forms of domination. Nikolai, on the other hand, oh dear, I'm involving you in Synedrion drama, aren't I? My apologies. Good luck with the mission. Okay. Okay. Oh, complete research in the manufacturer. Can we look at this? Okay. It just needed to be anything. Okay, we're not gonna revert uh engineer their neuron pistol just yet. I mean eight days is a fucking lot. Okay. Now where is this mission located? Hmm. Quick heal. Okay, crucially healed. There's still the mission here. Let's check diplomacy for the new Jericho. Okay, they only like us 9%. If we take this mission with the new faction, the undefendable. We're going to have to fight everybody. I mean, we're going to probably have to fight Jericho. So let's see about the Against the Mist. Okay. Uh, mist Repeller technology can, could change the course of the war against the Pandora virus. Could even make a peace possible. Fuck that. <clears throat> Fuck that. I mean. But testing the tech is dangerous. And the labs frequently come under attack. We must ensure the test can be successful, successfully completed by eliminating any potential hostiles. All right. One save. Now we've got a couple level ups. Let's look at the training. All right, unlock a new class. I'm all down for that shit. Okay. For this, we could take a sniper, a sniper class, or a heavy training. A sniper heavy. I'd like a sniper with dis with the uh, dash ability. Quick game. Yeah. 
Let's do it. Probably should have waited. Wait, how many points? Oh, it takes 50? Oh, shit, that's a lot. I didn't realize that uh, this cost 50 points to do it. Shit, that's a lot. Hmm. Mark for death. That's the baby. I want that so bad. That and rapid clearance. Whew. Those are so good. He's got 36. Yeah, him. I want to wait because I want that 50. We'll wait for the 16. Shall we get the next level? Hopefully that gets us to 50 near. Okay, ammo. Grenade. Could I give him the neuron pistol? Laser pistol with 50 damage. The neuron it only does 10, but it gives a 30. And a uh, paralysis. A range of 70. Hmm. Nah, we're gonna wait for now. Deploy the squad. Moving next to a low wall or obstruction uh, obstacle, your soldier will cross. Uh, posture protecting the body from attack. Secure the area. I mean, there's nothing that I need to protect. I would, I hope. Could be wrong. I'll keep my eyes open. Moving. Man, this weapon has a lot of shots. Decent damage with 50. Position. I mean, with a mission, would secure the area, I don't even have to, I'm like, search for the enemies. I could have them wait to come to me, which would be awesome. I would not mind that as a mission. Just in case they come around that corner there. We can take it smooth and easy Moving for this out. one. Hopefully. <laughs> oh, fuck! Oh shit, I was not expecting that. You, you only take one shot to hit. Right there. Enemy killed. Moving. 
Oh, come on, boss. I'm here. Take that handgun. I'll get it next time. I was like, Lost brother? Come on, man. What's our move? I gotta move. I got me a serious problem. I know exactly what this is, and it is a big ass problem. Here goes this warm fuck. I should see him from here. There he is. It's what I think it is, isn't it? Fucking hate this chunk fuck. A Sharon. I don't know if they do physical damage, but they're basically a, they're a movable hive. They just shoot warm shits at us. Like in the beta, but... At least that's what I remember them doing. Who has running ability? Dash. I need you to dash, brother. Dash all the way over here. Moving to position. Targeting. Okay, that removes the launch fireworms. I don't think. Wait. Do they shoot highs? Okay, that shoots fireworms. But that's the most uh, heavily armored part is their abdomen. Their legs are also heavily wounded. A grenade would work great for this. He's gonna shoot another volley at me. I gotta remember that there's these things up top. Okay. Take him. Yeah. There's still the one up top. Okay, he can only move very little. But, my god. Oh, I don't think I can hit him. I got a leg. Yes. Switch over. Identifying target. All right. One of the legs is gone, at least. Torso. Hmm. Twenty blood. Moving out. Wait, where's this enemy at? Fuck, he's behind me. Alright, he's gonna probably go around, hopefully. Aiming. Alright. Two of his four legs are disabled, at least. That should fuck up his mobility. 
And he'll bleed a while. Moving. Okay, that worm's gonna drop down. But there's also this uh, other scummy fuck over here. I'll keep my eyes open. No. Can't do it, huh? Moving out. Alright, he's gotta move out of the fucking way. Overwatch that position there. Moving to position. And let's overwatch this. I wanna be set up I wanna be ready for him when he starts coming at me. He's gonna bomb. Fuck. Hmm. I, I gotta get I him out of here. I'm ready. First, let's move him. Let's go. Out. Okay. Legs gone. Two legs. Let's pop that one. I'm not sure if the fire will increase. But he's still burning. I don't think he can even do anything. Get out of the fire. Can't even shoot. But I can is lower my will points by two for my next shot. Targeting. God damn it, I really needed you to not fuck that up. What's our plan? His, his armor is Moving guard now. tier. Moving out. Did I just destroy my def oh my god. Are you serious, brother? Wow. How powerful is that fucking gun? I mean, not defense-wise, but... Damn it. I think the fire spreads, but I can't remember. Oh, fuck. Can't go far, but he's gonna shoot a fire shit at me. Two. I've got to focus. Gotcha. How much life do you have, you fuckwad? 135. It's almost done. Here. Ready to engage. 
Oh my god, I can't believe I missed that shit. Are you serious? Holy shit. Channel open. Moving. Ready to engage. All right, I think he's done. Hmm, almost done. Damn it. So fucking close. There we go. Moving to position. Okay, that little fire shit is gonna fuck my guys up if he bombs. I gotta kill him. It seems overkill to use a grenade, but the consequences are, would be massive. Oh, fuck. Don't panic, man. Don't panic. You got a grenade launcher, too? Oh, I can't have that. I cannot have that. Jesus, this laser pistol is so goddamn good! What's our plan? Ready. Sort of. Channel open. Get in that body. What's our plan? What's our move? Don't walk through the fire, please! Huh. Moving out. Alright, you. Can you heal yourself? No, you can't. You can't even do that. Alright, I need you to, like, get somewhere safe. Channel open. Moving now. Overwatch that shit.
What are we doing? I need you to stop freaking out, boss. I feel like you either coming from the middle or you coming from the side here. Damn, you ate that shit. I'm sorry, what were you trying to do on that one? Oh shit, there's another one. Oh fuck! Where the fuck did you come from? Uh. Fucking bash that bitch. God damn it. How is it I don't see him? Receiving loud and clear. Don't have enough will points for that. Need a better position. How am I not seeing him? He's right there. He's right there. It smells like trouble. That was a kill. Jesus, these fuckers have shotguns. Fuck. God damn it, Richard. Fuck. It's a good ass soldier, too. Shit, he just walked up and wasted his ass. I'm glad you decided to help us. But I hope both the Phoenix Project and the Polyphonic Tendency can at least recognize that these attacks on the mist repellers aren't a coincidence. Somehow, the Pandora virus is defending its strategic interests. Tell me, do you think we can really coexist with something like that? Even if it's challenging, the, the approach is worth pursuing further. That's what Ooh. Sarah said too. Very well. I hope I'm wrong. That is a lot of a lot of material taking food and plus five. Replenish everything. We can do it now. Okay, Sid is now supportive of the Phoenix Project. Okay, the location of Sid's havens are have been added to the Geoscape. Defend them to earn a reputation. Failure to defend her, to defend a haven under attack will lose some support. Okay, we have. Oh, we can reverse engineer their equipment now, too. Pandora and Evolution. The Sharon. The Sharon's. Oh, the Sharon's Autopsy. That's right. Let's grab that. Alright, we'll start looking at this after we finish some of these tasks we already have. Alright, let's put you on the group.
We need to manufacture some weapons, man. Grenades, too. Before that'll take 12 hours. Another assault guy. Give me someone with a sniper rifle. Yeah, there we go. Oliver Ticker Trussell. Take him. Okay, undefensible still has four days before I can. Before I have to make a choice. So let's heal. Research complete. There it is, the Goliath. Okay, early mutations of this creature type are associated with the first misincursion of 2029. Okay, vast populations were compelled to walk into the sea under the influence of the mist, then reemerge somehow with the sea creature DNA and to create these monsters. Okay, we're now seeing increased number of atherons on land. The hypothesis is that land-based gestation structures are breeding atherons under the cover of a new mist outbreak. Okay, the new, the latest atheron mutations have little humanity left in them and are considerably more dangerous to civilian populations. The longer term danger is that we can expect their evolution to continue at a rapid pace. Okay, they have subhuman intelligence, uh, allows for melted weapons, uh, their reproductions, I uh, see, reproduction is by cloning and mutations and they are mostly located at, le at nest. Okay, they have heavy bodies and bony shields. Also been known for having jump abilities. Yeah, the weakness is that their arms can be shot off. Okay, while analyzing the Atheron exoskeleton biochemistry, we discovered the notes of Alexander Denchief. A Phoenix scientist who became obsessed with bioengineering an armor suit made from Atheron derived chitin. He constantly referred to revelations that came from his dreams and began to alternate alienate his colleagues with his weird behavior. Steins eventually banned him from this line of research. Unfortunately his madness consumed him and he fled Phoenix Point with lab, valuable lab equipment. See his files contain encrypted plans for an expedition into a Pandora mutation center located through his dreams. Okay we can attempt to decipher his files and get a location. Okay. We managed to pinpoint a location and we should send a squad to investigate. It's a long shot, but given what we know about Pandora mutation, he might have been onto something. Okay. They got a new mission for the Catacombs of Despair. Oh, jeez, that's on the other side of the goddamn planet. Okay, cruise fully healed. I'll get the Steins retreat. Operators have reached uh, Randolph Steins at Thurs private retreat. Okay, which we may where we may be able to find additional information that help us decipher his notes and make sense of his activities. However, scans indicate enemy presence in the area. Alright, we 
got everybody? Let's go. Oh, if we can destroy floors below enemies who have high ground, they'll fall and take damage depending on the uh, their fallen height. Well, this is going much better than my first playthrough. Wow, we can already see that fucker right there. Who's got a sniper rifle? I'm on my way. Hmm. Bleeding plus ten. Fuck. Damn. Does he still use the virus if he's a dazed? No, he doesn't. What's our move? I'll take that. Let's go. Reposition. Here. Let's go. Hell, I am not in a rush. Stretch that as far as I can. I got this covered. Shit, they're coming from the side. Ah, oh, fuck. Shit, I am really in the wrong location for this. No, can I take a shot on him? God damn it. Sniper, where you at? I need your help, bud. Ready to fire. Fuck his head off. Heading out. I fucked that up. I should have used dash. I'm 
I'm gonna put him out as a decoy. Right there. Where is this chameleon guy at? He should be right here. Are you fucking serious? What the fuck? What was Overwatch for? Because apparently it doesn't mean a goddamn thing. You know what? Fucking eat this headshot. Enemy kill. You fucking cunt. Ooh, another pistol. I'll take it. Okay, three points. That allows him to take two shots if I get this right. Look at that. And then I could use another, because he has eight, to take his second shot. Make sure that no one can be hit from there. Threat there we eliminated. Go. There we go. What's our move? Let's go. Can he overwatch from there? Yes, he can. Yes, you can, big boy. I'm on the move. Well, let's just overwatch this location just in case. Oh wow, is he trying to make a beat a break for it? What's our plan? He's got four of eight. He can move. Pushing on. Now what do you have? Do you have a grenade launcher or a machine gun? Yeah, you do have a grenade launcher. You're a problem. Who do I have that could pop him? Or at least take a pot shot on him. Moving fast. Now that's a bad move. Right there. They could both get hit with a grenade if I get too close. Can we jump? Oh, it's because I'm over here. Okay, I see. To position. Let's try this now. There it is. Taking action. All right, we're going to dash him. Just heal, just in case. Why well, take the risk? <laughs> if 
grenade. Oh wow, no? I thought you sure as hell was gonna try that shit. Damn it. I can't wait to give you a Goliath, man. No need to aim, just fucking blow up an area with some shit in it. Who's a level one? Nobody that's near this creature. God damn it, I fucked up. It's crazy to leave him out in the open, but... Fuck the glass. Oh shit, that didn't work? Alright, fuck it. Just... No, don't stand by. Oh fuck. What was I thinking? I'm here. I fucked that up royally. How many shots does he have? Two? I know. Use quick aim. Only gives him one quick aim point left, but he can fire this. Can't miss that. Heal real quick. Hmm, shit. I don't like him being out here like this. Put him here. That means the fucker's somewhere hiding. What's our plan? Moving to position. Let's do this. I'm on Overwatch. Sprinting to position. Okay, we gotta All flush set. him out. I'm going. On my way. Oh, I gotta obtain his journal. That's what it is. I think I killed all the enemies. I got this covered. Yeah, I think we everybody. I think we killed them all. I gotta get the journal though. Grab that shit. Job done. All right. OK, 
Okay, I've done. I've talked about this mission before. I mean, uh, the aftermath that they're completing this one gives me, I think, three more locations to explore. Okay, big batch of documents from the retreat should allow us to understand what Steins was doing. Okay, there it is. Frozen, prisoner of ice, and rise by sin and by virtue's fall. And a lot of tech and materials. I'll take that. And a cutscene. As the world fell apart around us, it was difficult not to feel guilty. Some chose to be proactive and fight, but not me. I came here instead. My best weapon is my mind, and I need silence to put it to work. The history of the Phoenix Project is a complex tapestry. In Russia, Turkey, Britain, Spain, not one unbroken lineage, but a tangle of organizations, each passing the torch to the next with only one goal, to protect the human race. But protected from what? Did they know about the Pandora virus, and if so, how? The answers are out there. So much has been investigated and collected and analyzed, but it's all scattered, lost. I don't know if it's possible to track it all down, but I have to try. There's only one thing I'm sure of. I can't stay here anymore. Okay, replenish for just 14 material? Yes. Okay. Three days left. Stamina's down. Lose eight stamina for every mission, so we're fine so far. Training, 56. That's enough for a new level. Sniper heavy just, just doesn't seem compatible. Big heavy weapon. Plus uh, long range ability. I mean, they're kind of the same, but one involves more weight. If I took heavy, I'd have to start putting points into a strength. So we'll take assault instead. And this is the bone. And this is why the dash ability is always key. We'll take that. I'm gonna put heavy on this one. I'm gonna make it a soul heavy for him. There's something that I think I may be able to form with this heavy. I think heavies get um, soldier rockets for their class. So mixing him with this ability opens up the soldier ability. Only time will tell whether I can actually use it. Overwatch, this is perfect. That way it only takes one point for this assault rifle guy to use overwatch. Hmm, 60. Take dash for him. If I take this bombarder, I would definitely have, when I get to new class, I would have to take heavy for him. I'd be locked. Otherwise, this would be a waste of time. But before that, we need willpower and we need speed. I gotta have speed. Oh yeah, this is the guy I picked up. Here, what is your class? There we go. Take that a sniper rifle, boy. Everybody gets a health kit and one grenade. After that, may God have mercy on your soul, boy. Research. Still working on the uh, Triton autopsy. And after that, we have reverse engineering, the colonies, hatching, and then the Sharons.
Manufacturing pretty good. Don't have enough for a scarab or a mana core. I really do need another one though, but that's for another day. Oh, that's right. The Goliath. There it is. The Goliath is what I want. Okay, Cedar Arc. Alright guys, Cedar Arc is a remote haven built by the billionaire Philampris, uh, Philampris Mike Spark, an old competitor of Tobias. Spark, like Wes, generally kept a low profile. Not much is known about him, except for his dedication to environmental causes. Okay, he financed the Salivard Global Seed Vault and was involved in the first attempt to develop a filtration system that could stop the Pandora virus. Okay, the population of Cedar Arc was carefully selected from around the world, and all of its inhabitants are extremely loyal to Spark. On the surface, everything seems relatively normal, but there's one unusual detail. Okay, the people of Cedar Arc refer to themselves as the Destined. Destined for what is unclear. This is the cult. Upon arriving at Cedar Arc, operatives are invited to meet the head of Cedar Arc Executive Council, Spark himself. He's a quiet man, but very focused. Okay, he seems to have an ex. Uh, he seems to have expected our operatives arrive and offers them a mission: exchange his brother from a disciples of a new prison in exchange for reward. We could inform the disciples. Let's see what happens if we do that. The blind Leggett thanks us for letting us know about Cedar's attempt to free Mason Spark, a man the disciples consider very dangerous. They will double his security immediately. Unsurprisingly, Mike Spark is enraged and vile and vows that we will regret this betrayal. Shit. Oh, it seems like it's an independent station. Oh well. This did put us higher up on the uh, disciples' ability. We still want to get them higher. Okay. Disciple sight. The Goliath 2 is finished! You know what that means. Caffin, get rid of that piece of shit you have. Drop that. Get this, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that, baby. So beautiful! Give you some facial hair. Yeah. Got a grenade launcher, motherfucker. You can't have no goddamn mustache only. Can't wait. Ready to roll. Let's show them what we can do. I like yellow for this. Like caution. I kind of like that armor pattern, so I kind of like this one. Like explosions. Boom, boom. I'm down with that. Let's change your code name to Boom. 
Mike Boom Alexander, hell yeah. Mike Wax Vasquez, Caleb, Caleb, I mean. I don't know, man. You don't look like a Vasquez. Yeah. The hair color sucks, though. Give you green eyes. Makes you look weird. I like it. I'm prepared. No. Receiving. Receiving. Ready. Still alive. There, I'll take that. We'll take pattern seven. And level four. Speedster. Jeremy Speedster Pops too. Ready. Receiving. I can make a difference. Yes. I'm here. I think that's good. Like little patterns in his beard. Take that one. Okay, the Manticore Worm has flown over a burned out truck. Uh, the engine and cab appear to have caught fire, but the container section seems to be intact. Hmm, we did find food. I'll take it. Ooh, these sites are all over the fucking planet. Defendable, I need to do something in two days or do nothing. Scan complete. Okay, I got another Jericho site. Right, not yet. I want to do this Subject 24 mission, but I gotta wait. What I want to do is uh, area scan. Wait, no. Why is the area scan down here? Let's go out here. Warning. This is a transmission to the world. We are the pure. And our time hiding in the shadows is over! Squads of our chosen warriors are already combing the world in search of resources and technology that will help us defeat the Pandoran threat. A word of warning, don't get in our way. We will show no mercy, we will allow no bargaining. We are the Cure! <laughs> oh wow, that was the end? I like the sound effects at the end. <laughs> Breathes a lot of flair. Research complete. Hmm. We got shotguns! The Mercy SG3! Let's see. Early versions of the mutation were identified on video streams in 2027. And seen in greater number during the second miss 
of 2040. The current Tritons have evolved to the extent that they have intelligence to use human equipment. Hold on a second. Uh, <sighs> sorry. Okay. In addition to their human-like arms, they have a secondary appendages with various and specialized functions. Okay, their butter body parts reveal other variation and adaptations. Okay, we've seen increasing numbers of these creatures, often deployed upon atrons. Given their more base land-based adaptation, we can infer that they're being gestated in land-based structures within the bounds of the new mist outbreak. Let's see, their functions. Sufficient intelligence to use human weapons and sniper or assault roles, plus various stealth capabilities. They have good vision and perception. Primary arms, dexterous enough to use rifles and handguns. Secondary arms with close counter capabilities, paralyzing and piercing. They do have miss emissions, coming in like invasions in response to attack and rapid re uh, regeneration. See, the mobility is an agile variant with high junk. Okay. Their weakness is that their skin, thin, uh, thick skin provides less protection than the Atherin's Shinton plating. I don't have any material, though. I need to get some. Continue exploring. Okay, operatives have set down in an abandoned supermarket. There could be supplies supplies that we can use. Okay, they found the remains of a camp inside the supermarket warehouse. It looks like the people tried to live here. However, there's no one left alive and very little we can use. Can we trade for food? No, no, we can trade two, two tech for materials, which is what we need. Take that shit. Perfect. Excellent. You know exactly what I'm gonna tell, me, tell the, my guys to make. The Mercy and the Mercy, uh, a Mercy magazine. Actually, let's make two, just in case. Yeah, I appreciate everybody coming in to watch oh, this uh, a second gig guys. of Phoenix Point. Uh, I'm just, uh, this is where I'm going to take the cut in right here. Uh, when I head back, I'll probably release another one tomorrow. So, yeah. thanks for yeah, coming to watch. If you like uh, the video, like and subscribe. Uh, at Emily Ninja. I am out, guys. Take yeah, care. And green again, thanks again.